Hey guys, Jen here in the North View Model Shop with an update on the Canadian AVGP Grizzly Early. Okay guys, when we left off, we were in the primer stage and our primer stage, as you remember, was the gray Vallejo primer. We then went forward and laid down some NATO green. And then and we realized that you could also purchase some NATO green primer. So we could have eliminated two steps with one, but we didn't, so now we've learned. So now we have it for next time around. So we have our NATO green. The whole thing is a good, a nice, couple of nice coats in there, really laid in beautifully, letting it dry in between, obviously. Then follow in with the NATO black. And that gave us a beautiful, beautiful paint job. Really, really close to the reference we want to use. And this reference you should have seen in the first of this video. So there's where we're headed. Then, guys, we want to use all our Veoprex, so we don't have a lot of it, but we gave it what we had, and that was the satin varnish. And it laid down quite nicely, just a little bit of coats into there, gave us the room we needed to go ahead and decal. And decals, not very complicated on this one, just a couple uh, Canadian insignias, some markers up front, the sides, there's a, all the hooks have just like up in here is a tie down, and down here is a a hook, a recovery toe, the back has some emergency exits and emergency oxygen, and power hookups, another Canadian emblem, very important to us, and uh, tie downs right there. So not overly that complicated decal. I think decaling took us about half an hour, 45 minutes. We got it all done. Then we laid in with three or four coats of the micro saw just to make sure everything was flat. Nope, silvering was taken care of before we went back with another coat of satin, satin varnish. Guys, at any time, and if the Vejo product starts to give you a little bit of trouble, just a, a little drop of this here will really uh, really seem to thin things up and get her going really, really nice for us. So guys, that's where we are at right now. And we are getting really excited because it's time to start the process of weathering and finalizing everything. Now guys, there's a few spots you need to take care of, like these uh, smoke cannons there, smoke canisters. They need to be blackened and the aerials up here need to be blackened and there's a couple other things glass needs to be installed uh little bits like that but what's really exciting is we've got a whole new line of vallejo products and we want to really really give this mud and grass uh a little test ride we tested on something else just really quickly and really cool now a reference trail does not have a lot of this mud and grass everywhere so we're going to go very light into the suspensions and just kind of keep it low obviously but then we're going to follow in with a battery of some Vallejo products adding some uh, some light mudding and just where mud be throwing up from traveling and traversing mud holes and all that fun stuff maybe a stowaway frog or a grasshopper or a cricket or something like that and uh, that's when the fun really 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 starts so we're really excited for that all right, guys, hopefully you're enjoying the progress and the project so far. Stay tuned for the next update. Adios.